You are so pretty, Brittany. Pretty even rhymes with your name. Does it? Really? Make sure that you're subscribed to the channel and click the bell to turn on notifications so you never miss a video. If I hide here long enough, nobody will notice that I'm inside of this cardboard box and I can get away with not filming a gacha video. Oh. Hi guys! Yeah, I was just, uh, just chilling. So guys, we are back today with another gacha reaction. Today, we are going to be going through Miss Ballerina. I thought it sounded so cute and I need a break from all the tragic scariness of gacha. So this one should be a tame, relaxed, cute story. Let's get into it. My name's Jenna. I've been practicing ballerina ever since I was a kid. I wasn't the leader of any ballerina group ever since, but I've always wanted to be one. Though they say, I just don't seem good enough. Oh, Jenna, one day. Right. If you don't know already, that's our coach, Alexa. She trains us to do well in ballerina since we have a huge competition every year. She's nice but strict when it comes to winning. Left. Right. What's with the long face, Brit? Brit is one of the best ballerinas and most of the time gets chosen as a leader. She acts kind but is actually rude. She's the favorite of the coach. Well, I'm just worried for Jenna. She's not doing the pose correctly. Maybe send her to the back so she can learn. I mean, I want our group to win. How could I have not noticed that? Jenna and Kiara switch. Ma'am, no, I switch or you're out. Oh my gosh, it's all because of this girl harassing on us, getting us told off for being bad at the poses. Excuse me, we are learning. Yes. Oh, she is so sad that she's been put at the back now. Now. Let's continue. Right, left. All right, girls, our performance will be coming soon after practice. So I'm going to be picking a leader. So everyone try your best in these weeks before I pick a leader. All right, come back tomorrow. I'm obviously going to be the leader. Ciao, losers. She's so cool. And I'm beside her. Few minutes later, everyone left. Might as well do so. Oh, I forgot my jacket. Gosh darn it. Maybe the bus will be warm. It's really cold. Wait, isn't that Aiden's car? Get in, Jenna. Aiden? And geez, why aren't you wearing real clothes? Huh? I'm not gonna be cliche and put it on you. That's not what I meant. I just forgot to bring my jacket. All right, go walk back looking like a black dolphin. Actually, I changed my mind. Thanks for letting me borrow your jacket and for giving me a ride home. Anything for a friend you know? All right, I should get going. Bye. Wait, I forgot to return his jacket. Oh no, girl, you gotta keep it now. That's the rule. If he forgets his jacket, it's yours. I'm so cliche. I'll just give it back to him when I see him. Wait, why am I talking to myself? The next day. Mmm, cookies. Girl, I've been dreaming about cookies also pretty much every night, so I relate to this. Not the falling out of bed bit though. Oh gosh, I'm late for ballet class. Girl, don't cry, just get up, get ready. Oh, her eyes are kind of terrifying. Oh wait, it's Friday. Wait, didn't I have plans with Aiden? Well, I better get dressed up. No. Ew, what the heck is that outfit? No, no. Buttercup scotch, this is beautiful. She looks so cute. Wait, is that the Illuminati sign? Oh no. Where is she? Kaboom! Oh, hey, Jenna. Anyways, what did you want to tell me? I got a girlfriend. I think her name is Bri- Brit. Huh? Yeah, and I don't even like her. My parents are just forcing. Where are you going? Wow, imagine having a girlfriend and you don't even know her name. How strange. Home. I'm feeling sick. Why? Oh, she's so jealous right now. Oh dear. Aiden, stop. I'm all right, okay? Oh, that's not Aiden. How embarrassing. I knew it. So you're the one who keeps hanging around him. Well, guess what? Aiden is mine, not yours, all right? Now, if you won't stop hanging around, I'll make matters worse. Hey, what did you do to her? I should rest. Soon after, I started noticing everyone praising Brit. And when they did, I also noticed that she was perfect. I adored her, but I hated her. Is this jealousy? You are doing great, Brit. I don't know. 
Maybe you should teach Jenna. She'll be able to learn a thing or two from you, Brit. Of course. Listen, I don't even want to help you. This is after practice. Huh? I just wanted to talk to you privately. Oh no, this is bad news. What? Look at me while I'm speaking. Aiden and I are getting engaged soon. I'll just give you a second warning. Oh no, she is all kinds of crazy jealous. This is terrible. Don't come near him. This is literally the worst kind of girlfriend, the jealous one that doesn't let you hang out with any of your friends. No, she's terrible. You'll never be as good as me. After that incident, I started practicing hard every day. People began to worry that I was overworking, but I just shrugged it off. I needed to be the leader at least once, but I just shrugged it off. I needed to be the leader at least once. Are you sure you aren't tired? I needed to be Brit. Yes, and at the same time, I wanted to be her. Even though she was rude, she was perfect. Pretty, talented, wanted. That was all I wanted right now, to be her. People question and say, why am I doing this? Can't I just be myself and be simple? They don't understand. They don't know how it feels. Soon after, I slowly started to avoid Aiden. Jenna! He would try to hang out and talk with me. I mean, yeah, who wouldn't want to hang out with someone who's their friend? Look at how she's wearing this coat right now. She's literally wearing it off of her shoulders. Like, is there any point in even wearing it then? Well, I wanted to be much more than friends, but I felt selfish. Selfish because he had Brit, his soon-to-be wife, and I didn't want to ruin that for him. Because who would try to ruin something for someone they love? I left him there, confused, broken, and it was for his own good. I'm happy for him, right? But there's great news. It's on my weight. For the past days, I used to be upset about my weight. I'm thinner, but now I've changed. I've became thinner and thinner since I've only drank water for the whole time. What? Girl, you better be eating. Are you insane? You need to eat food. That is so unhealthy. You can't just drink water. I loved it. I finally got my dream body, but not in the correct way. This is so bad. The next day, coach was gonna pick our Miss Ballerina, the leader which was the perfect timing with my weight. But there's a weird part. I started vomiting blood. What? Probably because you're not eating food. This is terrible. Ballerinas are thin and graceful and I finally look thin and graceful. So I left it and hoped it would just heal by itself. The next day, I'm now going to be choosing our dove, the leader. It's pretty obvious she has a beautiful body. Before she even said it, I knew it was me. Everything she described was like me. Pretty face and light striking talent. If I call your name, come here. Well, it turns out I was completely wrong. Brit, you are the dove. Everything I did, the weight, the overwork was for nothing. Tomorrow was the competition and I couldn't back out even if I wanted to. I thought to myself that I deserved this because apparently I wasn't good enough. The next day, competition day. Oh my goodness, they look so cute. You are so pretty, Brittany. Pretty even rhymes with your name, does it? Really? I don't think it does. We should actually compliment Jenna that she even made it to be in our group. Okay, I really do not like her. I guess? Stop acting nice, Brit. You are a monster. Stop being rude to me. Stop blackmailing me, Brit. Where are you two going? I've said too much. She's gonna do something bad now. Trying to destroy me. Trying to ruin my reputation. Don't run, cause I'll make sure that you won't be able to perform tonight, you little snitch. Ladies, get in action. Brit, what were you doing? Madame, I was simply helping her fix her hair. I mean, if you don't like me doing that, I'll stop. That's really nice of you, but there's no need to because you'll perform in three minutes. All right, we'll come. What are you gonna do? Hit me? Look, I tried to be as thin and as great as you, but yet you always seem to bully me. I'm sorry. I hope we can forget the past and stay as friends if you won't do it again. After that, Brit and I became friends and I finally had the energy to perform. I was happy. Oh wow, that happened really quick. Now they're friends. Thought I needed to apologize to Aiden. You can't leave someone you love confused. During the performance, Aiden is there. I really need to talk to him after this. Focus, Jenna. Oh, they look so cute. I absolutely love the flowers in their hair. Am I doing it right? Someone get help. She fell down. Oh my gosh, there's blood on her mouth. 911. Whoa, what? 
How did that happen? Everything happened so fast. Wow, she's like in hospital right now. What the heck? How did she fall over? Or was she sabotaged? Oh, I think she's coming too right now. Aiden, why didn't you tell me that you were starving? Shush. Oh no, it's from not eating food. That is so not healthy. Now she's in hospital. It's not the end of the world, you know. Not for you. You still have a chance. Don't say that. You'll live. We can't lie to ourselves, Aiden. I'm gonna die. I've starved myself too much. No. I'm gonna wait for you. You'll survive. We're just friends. Why are you doing this? You have Brit. You guys are gonna get married. I love you, okay? I love you too. But we can't be together. You're just gonna get hurt. I'm dying soon. I'll keep you safe. Good night, Aiden. More like, goodbye. Excuse me, sir. Are you waiting for Jenna? Yes, why? Well, um, you see, she died a few minutes ago after you left the hospital. All these memories for nothing. What? She died? Oh my gosh. I was not expecting that. Oh, that is terrible. This poor girl just wanted to be the best ballerina and has ended up dying through it. Wow. So sad. I'll miss you, Miss Ballerina. Oh, that was so, so sad. You may not be as perfect, but you are someone I love. Anyway guys, that is where today's Gacha Life video has ended. It was a really sad one, but if you did enjoy it, do make sure to leave a like. Here is the comment of the day, and I will see you guys in the next one.